natural. I also got this bamboo edge. And you, I don't have no edges, honey. My edge has been gone for years. And ain't nothing about bringing it back. No product, nothing. It's gone from them braids that mess my head up. Um, but I like to use this bamboo uh, edge control. And I got it just from um, one of my uh, beauty supply stores where you go and get your hair and wigs and stuff like that. Try the bamboo. So, you know, trying to save the environment. Hello everybody and welcome back to It Just How You Wear It. Well, yes, I did another big chop. I'm always chopping my hair off. If you're like me and you have, you want to go natural, so you want to get on the bandwagon, go natural, let your hair go into that big, thick mane of hair and put it in different styles, that didn't work for me. So when my hair grows, my roots are straight and my hair is fine and thin. So it never grew to that full head of hair that I love to wear out and style up. Sorry, I wasn't fortunate. But I didn't want to go back to perming my hair as well. I, my hair is, is very, it was very good texture. It was very good. Um, it just didn't grow. So it didn't get the length and the fullness. So what I do is when I'm tired of bringing it up and putting on my wigs, I will cut it off. But anyway, today's video is not only about the big chop. Um, I'm also going to show you new in beauty items that I have and a few items that I got from Bath and Body Works sale as well. So let me start off first with the beauty items. So the first thing I got is I got some, I love, you know I put nails on now. So what I do is I leave my nails natural. After the quarantine, I never went back to get my nails done at the shop. So I'll go for a manicure because I can't do manicures. I didn't know how important a manicure was until I went without one trying to do my own, just fouling them. But you need that dead skin off. You need you need a manicure. So I went and I got a manicure and I just let them uh, paint my nails. But I plan on putting my nails back on. I do wear the, um, the glue on nails. So I got these nails from a um, black owned uh, small business. She is on Instagram, so I'll put her information here. So I got these nails and when they come, I love the way it comes packaged. Well, when she sent it packaged, you can see how it looks, what the nails will look like. So I got this ombre purple, is it not? It's so pretty. And she has her name on the packaging. So I got this color and this beautiful pink with the design nails as well. So once this get old, I will be styling it and I will wear these purple ones first and I'll do a, um, I do an Instagram photo. So make sure you follow me on Instagram. I am ages how you wear it everywhere. My blog, Instagram, Facebook, everywhere is ages how you wear it. So I will be styling these. So for my birthday, um, Sephora, cause I get Sephora, um, I'm on a VIP. So you know, they always give you birthday gifts. And my birthday was the end of January. So I got to choose this new NARS Laguana um, lipstick and bronzer. Um, it's very pretty. So let me show you the lip. Look, it comes in the, you know, these are just the little travel sizes. But it comes in this beautiful NARS packaging. I like the way they made the lipstick holder bronze. And this is the color. So I can't wait to really style this up, bronze myself up. And this is how the bronzer looks. Beautiful, right? So 
I can't wait to try that to see if I will get the full size. And from Fenty, I got the new um, Fenty Skin. So this is the um, the water one, the, um, what is it called, Fat Water. So what I like about this, and I've been using it, first of all, I love the fact that it just comes out the top of the bottle. So you can just close it up or you can um, open it up and put it on your skin and it comes out like a little gel and I'm not wasting no product. Um, maybe one day I'll do a, how I take care of my skin. Um, I think my skin is pretty good for 57. So I'll do my skin routine. If you would like to see that, just leave a comment below that you would like to see my um, skin routine but I wanted to try this and you don't have to put a lot and I pat it on um, and I'm gonna tell you after I use it for about a month I'll do a review on it so I got that and still in the beauty department I got this new deodorant I said that I want to start doing natural deodorant instead of all the deodorants with all the harsh chemicals I think it's pretty good to go natural if you have if you're that type of person that um some people just I'm gonna just put it out there some people get musty very quickly they can just be sitting in the house and their body chemistry is strong so they get musty faster but I wanted to try this each and every and I got it in the sandalwood and black pepper this deodorant is very good and it's all natural. I got it off of Amazon, so you could just look it up. That's the name of it. This is really good natural deodorant. So if you're now into trying to make sure that you don't have all these harsh chemicals in your body anymore and you want things to be more natural, I would recommend doing that. And speaking of natural, I also got this bamboo edge. And you I don't have no edges. Next. Uh, speaking of face things, um, I actually got this white seed. You see it? It's the white seed and this is uh, a brightening serum. And it has been making my skin brighter. I'm not trying to do a Michael Jackson way. I'm trying to get <laughs> white skin. But to start taking care of your skin and get all any of the like you get the little black bumps and stuff if you want to brighten your face up so as I wash my face I use this bright brightening cream serum and it is working so I re I would recommend and it's white seed and I got this off of Amazon as well let's see and um speaking of edges and putting on weaves and stuff like that I've been trying this got to be glue um spike and wax this is what i'm using now that my hair is short my hair looking flat um so i've been using this let's see um i got a new eyeshadow and this is from uh let me make sure i say it right louis Ten. okay or louis Ten. Yeah, because when I say it, sometimes it sounds like it's coming out Louis Vuitton, but it is the Louis Vuitton, the red bottom. This is their um, eyeshadow, and this is a like a nudie pink uh, liquid eyeshadow, and I do have it on. Let me close my eyes, and hopefully you can see it. It's the um, the lighter pink on my eyes. So I'm trying this out. I'll let you know how it is because this is my first time using it. And the lashes that I'm wearing is my all-time favorite lashes by V-Lux. And these are the Envy. And I always keep me a pack handy. Um, I like these lashes. They're not too big. They're there when you need them. And not too overwhelming. Cause I really can't see. You want me to have some lashes on that's so big I can't see through the lashes either? I can't do it, honey. Okay? Save that for the young ladies. <laughs> I can't do it. All right. So, the next thing I got um, in the luxury department is I got this Maison uh, French's 
what they call it. Um, but I got it in the body cream. So the the perfume is a little strong for my liking. So I said I would try the body cream. Um, it's still forever. Do you understand me? Forever. They're going to bury me with this on right here. So I put this lotion, this body cream on and I put it with another perfume that's a little sweeter. It smells so good. Okay, so see, I'm not keeping you long. So my last items are items that I got from Bath and Body Work. They had their big sale and um, I took my granddaughter, me and her went and she got the buy three, get two. So, and they had a coupon for if you bought something over a certain amount, which if you get the buy three, get two, you've already done it. You get a extra body cream. So I got her extra body cream and I had a coupon because I got two, um, two of the candles that I'm going to talk about. And of course, I got the body cream for free. So let me tell you the two body creams I got. The first one is A Thousand Wishes. That's the first body cream. And this right here smells like, like a sweet candy. Like um, uh, this would be good uh, when you want. Because you know, Bath and Body Work, even though I love them, um, they are not for if you think you're going to have this on all day and you're going to smell it. That's not what Bath and Body Work stuff is for. It just isn't. But if you want to mix it with something, so if you mix it with a very strong, nice scented perfume and put this on, it's very good because this one is sweet. Mm. So it's sweet and it smells a little bit like pears. So if you had a stronger perfume on that's a little musty that's a little like a sandalwood or something like that put this on with it and it'll bring out the sweetness and have that balance this is the coconut cream pie this is for fun this is for when you get out of the shower and you just want to put some lotion on and walk around your house in case the delivery person come, you open the door, you just got a little smell that smells good. It don't seem like you just roll out of bed, which all of us has gotten in the habit of doing. So I'm trying not to do that. That's why I make my videos. I do not want to just lay around working, lay around working, lay around. I can't do it. So this right here is a good smell. Uh, going to the store, going just out to lunch, this right here especially when spring comes. So the last two items, guys. So this is my favorite mahogany teal um, candle from Bath and Body Works, but now they got it in a high intensity. You don't have to burn this long. I burn this in my bedroom. Just burn it for a little bit, then come blow it out because it will have your room smelling so good. And it did intensify. So it is stronger because you know I buy the original one. And the one that I'm burning in my kitchen is the limoncello, the limoncello. Um, and that's this one. And you know, they all essential oils, so they burn better and they smell good. Um, one day I wouldn't mind investing in something like some Joe Malone candles just to see how it is. Or some, um, I think it's called Dap, Dap, Ki, da. I don't know. But and uh, uh see the difference and when i get my bath and battle works candles and one that is a little more pricier i might try that and let you guys know how it is so that is my little mini beauty haul and to show you that um i cut my hair and don't be afraid to do new things don't be afraid and don't think that you have to have hair flowing down your back that's what I love about wigs. You can change a look, hang that wig up, have your another look. Because now I will be rocking my bald head going forward. So you may see a bald head. You may see a curly head. You may see some braids. Child, do you. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.